Hey everybody, this is Brian Jump with the Superior Auto, Auto Institute at NoDance.com. Uh, we're out here today in the spring of uh, 2010, semi-beautiful day, uh, one of our auto auctions. And I'm here today to show you our uh, spring 50-piece uh, set, break it down to show you what you get in the set, what the tools are like, uh, the tips and everything else, so everybody understands what comes in the set and what it looks like and all that. So the camera will follow me in here. I'm going to show you the wire piece set first of all. You get a nice assortment of wires, including J-hooks, uh, hand tool wires for a variety of different uses, and I'm going to show a couple of those uses right now. First of all, the camera will oblige me. If you come in, you'll look at these tools. They're CNC uh, machined, nice and smooth, come with a CNC machine, not hand ground, nice and shiny. They're polished. Each tool has been uh, ground flat and nice and smooth for accurate use. Some tools, here's one tool right here, this is what we call a J-hook. This tool right here also, of course, the tip is CNC machined. You see how sharp it is on the tip for uh, nice cutting action for getting into those tight areas. The uh, J-hook, for those of you that aren't a PDR tech, these are mostly used for going down uh, the glass on a vehicle, coming down where the, we'll put a wedge in here, come back up, and hook up underneath this top brace that's almost evident in most of the vehicles. J-hooks are a great tool, and you get a couple of those in every set. A short one and a long one. Um, a couple other tools that are in your set are these hand tools. There's a variety of different lengths and uh, sizes, and these are for getting into tight areas, usually on a hood um, or a trunk area where there's cross braces. And I'm going to show you how to use those in a second. And speaking of cross braces, I'll bring out the, uh, the Z-bars. Every set gets a, a small pack of Z-bars. These are very similar usage as the hand tools, a little bit wider. But the same idea, a little bit thicker as well, so if you got a little more of a gap, you can get these in, or if you have to go with a smaller tool. And if the camera will follow me over to the hood here, I'm going to show you how to get access with these tools right now. If you look under the hood here, you're going to see there's a cross brace, like you'll see in uh, also trunks and also roofs. And you can either use one of your Z-bar tools for sliding it under the brace, and either twisting or pulling back up to get leverage to push it down out, or you can use a smaller hand tool to get the same action. Also, we'll, we'll use these tools for fitting through holes sometimes if we can uh, tweak our way through to get into dents. A lot of times the plugs will come out and give us more access or even plugs down here. Um, these tools are great, like I said, for using on uh, hoods or trunks or roofs. And in, in each set there's a, a large variety of different shapes, lengths, and bends of wires, but with all the braces you'll see in, uh, our, tool, in our tool sets, Actually, in vehicles, it's important to have a large, a wide variety of, of brace wires uh, to do adequate PDR and for access. And you can see these are all made out of stainless, stainless steel, and they're very strong. They're excellent tools. This is what all of our techs, including myself, use every day. Okay, now I'm going to pull out the pick tool set. Oh, and every set also includes a. Uh, CNC ground PDR tap down, precision ground for perfect use. Okay, here's the pick tool portion of the set. In here, you're going to find a large variety of large and small tools. I can somehow give these suckers to come out of here. There's a hand tool for getting into close proximity. Another hand tool. Here's another hook tool, but not quite as, as finely ground for a little bit wider open area. You'll see that the tip is uh, more of a uh, what we call a rat tip instead of going flat tip on the other brace wires if you've got a bigger area if you want to go in for that. Another hand tool here. Here's one of our window tools. You'll notice it's got a, a double kick right here, so when you're going down the glass, the tool, like most other tool companies, is straight and that'll hit the glass. Well, even if the glass goes down halfway, you don't have to worry with this because it's bent. Gives you more leverage for twisting. Then you got the hockey style tip at the tip going down here into the door for twisting out your dents in, in the glass access on the doors. And then there's a larger variety. Here's even a bigger window tool. If you notice it's much thicker for going down maybe a big, like a F250 or F350 window. There's a general purpose pick. These are great for going into hoods or doors, just a lot of different uses. Another window tool with a softer tip for a, like a big soft dent in a door. Take a look at that, it's been precision ground as well by CNC. Look how smooth it is, it's not ground by hand. 
more of the miscellaneous hand tools, general purpose. And then here's some of the larger picks. Once again, nice big ball tip for soft dents. Here's a beautiful blade tool. Once again, CNC ground, beautiful, sharp for taking sharp creases or sharp dents out. Every set gets two of those blade tools, one small, one's big. There's another one, you can look at the precision on that, much longer tool. These tools alone go for usually over $100 in a lot of other sets. Pretty big bargain with us. And here's a big uh, regular uh, ball tip pick for large access uh, in a hood or roof, what have you. So there it is, 50 piece set from Superior, 2010 spring. Thank you.